Imagine logging into your banking app and seeing a balance of zero. Now imagine this same jump scare happening to millions of others too, all at the same time. Now imagine being the banking executives responsible for sorting all this out. <laughs> Yikes. In April of 2018, this was exactly the scene facing TSB, a major UK bank. Nearly 2 million customers had been locked out of their accounts, or were seeing wildly incorrect balances. It was pure chaos. Regulators had to swoop in. The CEO admitted publicly, we're on our knees. A cyber attack, you might assume? Actually, no. This was something far more mundane. A botched IT migration. Mundane, but devastating. Specifically, the IT migration in question related to TSB's core banking system, aka the CBS, the critical back-end platform that maintains accurate records of customer accounts, transactions, and the various financial products. Without a functioning CBS, a bank simply cannot do much banking. So why was TSB tinkering with such a critical part of their tech stack? A change in ownership. TSB had recently been sold by Lloyds Banking Group to Spain's Banco Sabadell, which wanted TSB integrated into their own core banking system. The goal was to standardize processes and reduce combined IT costs. As they say, there's always a catch. Nearly any strategic move a bank makes, whether a merger, entering a new market, or launching a new product, will require changes to the CBS. Herein lies the big CBS challenge. On one hand, for many traditional banks, core banking systems are old, complex, and fragile patchworks. Changes are difficult, and the risks are high. But, on the other hand, financial technologies are evolving rapidly. Even the oldest banks are expected to provide smooth digital experiences and keep up with the latest products and trends, like peer-to-peer -peer payments, digital wallets, and crypto assets, not to mention never-ending regulatory changes. Want to support real-time payments, for example? You'll need back-end systems that can process in real time. As the saying goes, tech innovators move fast and break things. Banks are expected to keep up, but without ever breaking anything at all. Consequently, any CBS-related initiatives will be high stakes and high visibility across the executive team and board. For professionals seeking to partner with banks or any of their tech priorities, understanding these systems is simply essential. This primer provides the foundation you need. We'll cover who uses core banking systems and for what purpose, the key processes enabled by the CBS, the landscape of available CBS solutions, and the roles and stakeholders involved.